Yes people, what's happening? Welcome back to the channel and welcome to another match day vlog and another away day. I'm on my way to Brighton for the Graham Potter derby. Brighton versus Chelsea in the Premier League. It's going to be a tricky afternoon for the Chelsea. Unbeaten in nine under Potter, can we make it 10 games? Roberto De Zerbi is looking for his first win as Brighton manager and there's no bigger incentive than the former gaffer coming back to town. So this is going to be a really tricky afternoon. Brighton are going to be bang up for this. The players will be more up for it as well. I think the Chelsea have got what it takes to, to get the job done and get another three points in the bag but this is certainly not going to be an easy game but yeah guys make sure you smash the likes on the video subscribe to the channel and i'll catch you at the stadium up the chelsea and up the potter Right, just in the concourse at Brighton and I've got to go and sample the pies. Loads of people that have been here before have told me that these pies are the best in the Premier League, so it'd be rude not to try it out. Stay tuned, people. Hi, guys. This actually is fucking unbelievable pie. We're one goal down in the first five minutes. Looks like Leandro Trossard has scored. We've been really sloppy. Two goal line clearances from Thiago Silva. We're back in trouble here. Terrible, terrible start.
Because I'm here at the Alex and Graham Potter's return. It's an absolute horror show on Halloween weekend from the Chelsea so far. 3 0 down and it's been absolutely awful. The system is not working at all. For me, you just cannot play two wing wingers as wing backs with no defensive qualities in the Premier League. They're getting torn apart. They haven't got enough defenders on the pitch. And it's just an absolute shit show. Cabrera has been awful. He's getting done by March every time. Trossard's causing problems. The whole front line's causing problems. And Nojo, we could easily make five subs at half time. It's been that bad. So, a big second half game. I don't know if we can salvage anything from this game. I think it's highly unlikely. But if it was almost we could just try and win the second half or something like that. But yeah, that was absolutely awful. And I guess it was just written on what was turning. We're going to get smashed.